Hey, what's going on guys? My name is Omega and welcome back to another Apex Legends video. So in today's video, I decided to kind of go over some of the weapons that were in Titanfall 2 that I think could potentially make it into Apex Legends. Now, for those of you guys that don't actually know, the Apex Legends game is based off of the Titanfall universe. So basically, all of the guns that have appeared in Titanfall over the years are now in Apex Legends, including the new L-Star weapon, which we know is going to come in the next like week and a half. Uh, that is just a regular old gun in Titanfall 2. And basically, all of the weapons from Titanfall 2 have mostly appeared in Apex Legends, besides a few, which makes me think that sometime in the future, we are going to get these weapons in Apex Legends. So I'm going to go over what those weapons are, including some grenades and other things that might actually appear and yeah hopefully this will be a cool video for you guys be sure if you guys are not already subscribed to drop a subscription it'll definitely help me out a ton and you guys will always be notified whenever i upload a new video but anyways let's get right into this so the first gun that i found is called the car smg and basically the description of this gun is that it has a high rate of fire and excellent accuracy if you like to run and gun check out the car so you guys can kind of see gameplay of this in the background. It really just reminds me of kind of like an underpowered R301. Um, in terms of Titanfall 2, the stats are very similar to the R201, which is basically just kind of like the same thing as the R301. The only thing that the car has over the R201 is that its magazine size is a little bit bigger. Unfortunately, I can't really just like translate what these stats would be in Apex Legends, but if the car was added into Apex Legends, I assume it would be just a very slightly less powerful version of the R301, depending on what you're using it for. The damage and the accuracy seem to be a little bit lower than the R301, but the magazine size would be bigger, so that makes me wonder if the R301 and the car would work really well together, just because the car would be better at close to medium range, and the R301 would also be good at medium range, but you could also snipe people at long range, depending on how well you actually control the uh, the accuracy but yeah this next gun that I found would actually work really well in Apex Legends and it is called the Volt SMG and the description that it has on the weapon list for Titanfall says it shoots electrified bolts rather than bullets which gives this gun excellent accuracy low recoil and a large magazine so compared to the other weapons in Titanfall and what I would think it would be you know useful in Apex Legends I think this gun would just work perfectly as an energy SMG weapon which is a weapon that we haven't actually seen yet in Apex Legends and since we already have an assault rifle we have an LMG uh, we don't have any pistols or shotguns or SMGs. I assume that the SMG would probably be the next best bet of what we would actually be getting. And according to Titanfall, this gun is actually super accurate. And you guys can see in the gameplay in the background, I mean, this guy's literally just running around hip firing people from across the map. Now, I'm not sure how accurately the weapons in Titanfall 2 have been copied into Apex Legends. I assume there's a lot of different stat changes because I doubt you would see anyone running around just hip firing like that, especially at the long range that he's doing it with. Like it just seems like the Volt is extremely powerful in Titanfall 2. The one reason that I'm excited for it is because it would be the first energy SMG weapon added into the game. And so far we know that energy weapons are probably one of the most overpowered weapons in the game. The Havoc is insane. Devotion is really good as long as you control the recoil. Uh, basically this weapon would be the same thing, having really good accuracy, low recoil, a large magazine, so it'd be perfect for kind of like medium to long range as well as close up range. The only downside is that the fire rate is a little bit lower than uh, the other SMGs, but it kind of makes up for it in the fact that it's super accurate and has a larger magazine size. So another thing in Titanfall that I found that was really cool is something called the Gravity Star. So already Titanfall has a bunch more grenades than Apex Legends does right now. And I think that having more grenades in Apex could be something that could really change how the game is played. So what the Gravity Star does, it says when thrown, this grenade creates a miniature black hole that sucks in enemies and any projectiles before it explodes. So it looks like this is kind of like an arc star that you throw, but instead of actually like exploding and stunning people, it pulls people inward, sucks them in, and then kind of like shoots them out after it explodes. I'm not sure how hard it is to actually get out of one of these, whether it's even possible to get out of a Gravity Star when it's thrown. I assume if you're already in the center of the Gravity Star or if it sticks to you you're definitely not getting out but if you're kind of in you know the outskirts of it you can get away although you will be slowed considering that you're being pulled backwards at the same time but I can just imagine how this could really change team fights in Apex Legends especially if you're going 1v2 or 2v3 against another team you can easily throw this gravity star into the center 
and either catch people off guard or just pull them all into the center of the gravity star and basically just light them up with whatever weapon you have. I could see this running perfectly with the devotion or the havoc, especially now that we're going to have the energy mags, which is basically just in uh, extended mags for the energy weapons. And I think that's going to be absolutely insane when that gets added. But yeah, gravity star seems pretty OP. So another grenade that would definitely be cool to see in Apex Legends is called the Electric Smoke Grenade. And basically what this does is as you throw it and it shoots out its smoke, anyone who steps through the electric smoke will be slowed, damaged, potentially stunned. I'm not really too sure how it works. Uh, the only reason that I think this probably won't be added into the game is because we already have Bangle or Smoke ability. So having uh, her ability plus the electric smoke grenade, like I could just imagine literally fights being covered in smoke all the time. And I don't think that would be very fun to play in. One thing they could do if they wanted to add this into the game is instead of making it kind of like thick, dark smoke, it's more of kind of like an electric mist, just so you can actually see people through it and it doesn't get too overpowered when Bangalore throws out her smoke. I just think that would be way too much going on in a fight at one time. Now, unfortunately, the other weapons in Titanfall are basically all like grenade launcher type weapons and they're more for taking out pilots than they are for just kind of like hand-to-hand -hand combat so i don't think any of those weapons will be added into apex legends it's going to be interesting after you know the game kind of adds everything that it wants to add from previous titanfall games what kind of designs they're going to come up with for new weapons i definitely love to see a new sniper rifle a new shotgun i'm not really too sure what exactly I would like to see in these weapons, but I will probably make a video sometime in the future talking about new weapons that could potentially just be designed that would work perfectly in Apex Legends considering the weapons that we already have and basically where the meta is going to be going in the future. But if you guys enjoyed this video, please be sure to drop a like on it. Let me know down below which weapon you guys would love to see in Apex Legends. Personally, I would love to see the Volt SMG. It looks really fun and really cool to play with, and especially since it would be the first uh, energy SMG added into the game. I think that's definitely going to be the next weapon that's added after the L-Star. But again, thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you guys have an awesome day, and I will see you guys next time. Peace out. And I got this soda.